Hey, Stavi. Hey, Aldis. Love the podcast. Uh, I have a problem that I think you're going to really enjoy, and that is that I was banging my roommate. I'm 32. She's 27. Okay. We nice were complete man. strangers when we moved in together in May of last year. Pause I was this. blown away at how attractive this Listen to the glee in this fucking guy's voice. <laughs> hey, guys. You can hear his teeth smile. You can hear his lips curled up in a smile. This guy's looking like the fucking the Joker right now. <laughs> Hello, guys. I fucked my roommate. Anyway, keep going. Girl is. She's exactly my type. Five foot one, super fit, red hair, very cute, and doesn't want kids. Doesn't want I didn't kids. want things to make to be awkward, so it was always very respectful. It wasn't putting Close the moves on her. Again. <laughs> she doesn't want kids, man. This is so fucking funny. You're fucking your roommate, and that comes up. Although I don't want to. This. I, just in case, this guy also could be on the spectrum. I am getting a little bit of that vibe from him as well, so I don't want to be ableist here. But anyway, keep going. But after five months of living together, we go out for a Halloween weekend. Uh, she was Sasha, Sasha Browse, which is like some anime character, and I was Forrest Gump while he was running. And we ended up making Pause it again. Of this bar. <laughs> Wow, well, that's a real specific Forrest Gump. Type. He's yeah, he's not just Forrest Gump. He's running Gump, and I mean yeah, okay. That was Forrest Gump when he was eating ice cream. Yeah, <laughs> I was when he was contracting AIDS from Jenny. <laughs> but okay, now the maybe he is autistic. With each detail, I'm like, okay, this guy might be autistic. There's not a more on the spectrum hero than Forrest Gump. Anyway, keep going. Are? Uh, the next time we saw each other, about a week later, we went to my room and we banged, which was pretty neat. I know Stabby's World is a pro pussy eating podcast, and I'm That's very true. happy to report that you'd be very proud of me. <laughs> and after the initial banging, we ended up spinning every night together, uh, where we were banging all the time. And I'm pretty confident I was laying at least all right pipe. But after a couple weeks of doing this in December, I asked you for exclusive, and not because I have feelings for her, but because I want to raw dog that pussy. Oh my and god, she says she hasn't banged anyone brutal. else, and I believe her because we're spending every night together. But after that say? conversation, we never banged. He said, I, but "She said she wasn't banging anyone else, and I believe her because we're spending oh, every night." By together. the way, beautiful way for her to slither out of that one. <laughs> you want to be exclusive? Well, I'm not fucking anybody else. She didn't say yes, pal. She said she wasn't fucking anyone at that time. She just fucking got your ass. But anyway, keep going. Again. She starts avoiding me, and after a week, I just straight up ask her if we're still a thing. She says no, and that's fine. It's never, like, been super awkward or anything, and we're, like, we're mature about it. But fast forward to today, 10 months later, and I'm a little bit of a dry spell. I'm an all right-looking dude and can usually get laid, later. but not recently. I've only been laid a couple of times since her. So my question for you is, how do I bang my roommate again? Help me, Stabby baby. You're my only hope. All right, thank God guys. damn. All right, so I want to take back the stuff I said because this guy is without question 100% autistic. He's like, it's not awkward. We're very adult about it. 100% it's awkward. 100% she just changed her mind and you're, you're missing a social cue or two. And to try and fuck her again after she made it pretty clear she doesn't want to and your roommates is insane. I don't but understand like the whole thing like, well, we were able to avoid each other. Where, like, didn't go in the kitchen? At the same yeah, time? Yeah, How yeah. big's this apartment? <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd say he should. Uh, so, he, but these other two women, he said he banged. He, he banged. He has banged two other past. women. Since yeah, why not her. them? Why aren't they the ones? But is they, is he bringing them home to his place when she's in the next room? My or? guess is yes, because that's you know. But who knows? I think I think he probably, if I had to guess. Trez tried to fuck them again, and it was kind of like a, mm -hmm. you know, not going to happen thing. And it looks like, look, here, what he did wrong was he slayed the golden goose. <laughs> he slayed the gold, like, she probably would have kept fucking you at least a few more times without you, but you had to immediately ask to be her boyfriend, which is, you know, and he even said it wasn't because I was excluded, it's not because I cared about her, it's because I wanted to raw dog, which is Pretty abhorrent behavior. <laughs> Will you marry me? I just I don't want to marry you, but I just, <laughs> I'd like to raw dog you. I'd love to go in. I'd love to go in au natural. He came in way too hot. I feel like he could have worked out a raw dog arrangement. This there. guy blew it ten ways to Sunday. Also, he probably did just catch feelings, and that just his. 
She's little true. looking back bullshit excuse to himself. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't care. Like, oh, dude, right. this bitch. Like a bravado even thing there. Yeah. I don't know, though, dude, because, again, not to be, <laughs> but I think he really was looking. Let's just put it this way. I think he was looking at it from, like, a, a mathematical equations perspective. So I kind of. I think. Uh, go ahead. No, no, please. I was going to say, I think it's probably best not to be banging your roommate. 100%. That's one of the most. So maybe it's a. Just accept and, and move Fully on. for the best. And in fact, the only way I would suggest you fuck your roommate again is if you move out. And then you can try her again. Look, we've all been there. Everybody's gone through the text. Ma- everyone's gone through the old people that used to fuck you. Everyone's, everyone's replied with hard eyes to an Instagram story. By the way, Halloween, one of the top times to get back in there. Someone, th- <laughs> someone You see an Instagram story with a, a hot costume, you're like... You crush this, and then see where it goes from there. Um, but yeah, dude, this is a bad idea. Just try and get your your when we're when we're pussy starved, we make crazy decisions. And also, and I this think is one of those. I mean, that could have conceivably ended really badly. And it sounds totally. like she just I'm not into this anymore. Exactly. Accept that. Leave her alone, and be happy that it didn't end fully. In a really ugly way. A hundred percent. Exactly. You. That's a great. That's a great point. These are. The, someone has to move out. Ninety eight percent of the time, this happens. If if they people or people either start dating for a while, and even then, at the end of that, they usually have to fucking move out. So you figured out a way where you don't have to get a new apartment. So until you get a new address, don't try and fuck this woman. I don't. I don't try. First of all, it's a high level maneuver to pull it off once and i think you lucked into it to pull it off twice unless you're like well the lease is up in two months <laughs> you know, but even then you're being kind of a dickhead she clearly you asked her pretty clearly are we still a thing she very clearly said no and you're trying to like uh you're trying to bring it up again it's one thing if you haven't seen the person and you can you get desperate and you can make up a narrative about how she might want to fuck you but you've seen this woman every day you know she doesn't want to fuck you again. Just move on, pal. Keep the dry spell. This is not the solution to the dry spell. You're drinking. This is like being like, I'm really thirsty. Should I try and suck some? Should I suck the water out of some mud? That's what you're trying to do here. Don't do it. 